Hello, my wonderful friends. Welcome back to my channel. It's Lowball Mama. And you all know what today is. It's a grocery haul. So if you know, if you have been with my channel for a while, you know how we do it. We're just going to jump right in. Okay, uh, this week we got some uh, ballpark beef hot dogs. And we also have two boxes of fully cooked uh, thick cut bacon. For quick morning breakfasts. And back there in the back. We have some Cheez-Its. And uh, we also have some. Star, Star Kiss lunch to go tuna kits. We like those for quick lunches. And I have uh, five packs of those. And then right up on top guys. I got me some. Um, two cups of uh, Quaker maple and brown sugar. Um, oatmeal cups. Got those for quick morning breakfasts. Gotta eat something a little bit healthy in the morning sometimes. So, yeah. And then right down here, guys, I ordered some um, bacon. Some great value bacon. But as you all can see, I don't know what's going on with that bacon. It looks like the seal has been broken. It's open in some kind of way. Because it's not even sealed uh, tightly. So, I'm about to call them and um, let them know I gotta get my money back off of that. Because, yeah, that's scary bacon. We aren't eating that. And then right here I got some um, strawberry Philadelphia whipped cream cheese because my kids wanted some bagels. And we got some cuties, little the little cuties um, tangerines. And I got a back bag of uh, Chip Ahoy, Chips Ahoy chocolate chip cookies. And we have some... Um, Nature's Own 100% Whole Wheat Bread. And I got some Thomas's Bagels. We have Blueberry. And also um, Cinnamon Raisin. And then back in the back right here, we got a box of, a large box of Eggo. We got Home Style Waffles this time. And I wanted some Ritz Crackers um, to go with my, I bought some canned tuna. So I'm going to make some canned tuna and I also bought some um, canned chicken. So yeah, I'm going to do that. And then like guys, if you make like a casserole or something like that, you can um, crush, of course, crush the Ritz up into little crumbs and mix them with a little bit of uh, butter. And you can use that to top your casseroles. It's even good like if you put it on some um, macaroni and cheese or something like that, or even if you just have a like a vegetable bake if you you know make some type of vegetable mix with some cheese or something yeah just crumble you some crackers up and add a little butter mix it together and sprinkle it on your vegetables it's really really yummy so got some more crackers and we got some more orange juice we've been going through orange juice pretty quickly because you know we're trying to drink a lot of orange juice get that vitamin c um to you know kind of keep away from Catching so many colds and stuff. So, yeah, we love uh, the Tropicana. Not sponsored in any way. Just uh, one of the orange juices that we like to drink. And then right back here, my son wanted some Hot Pockets. So, we got the Philly Steak and Cheese Hot Pockets. We absolutely love the um, Hot Pockets. There's one that has a um, the uh, crust that's like the, uh, oh my goodness, what is it? It's a softer crust. I can't think of the name of it right now. But it's one that comes with a softer crust. But we aren't able to find that one anymore. So we just get this one. This one has the regular crust. And then I wanted some um, oatmeal. Some more oatmeal. I get the fruit and cream oatmeal. This right here is delicious, guys. There's um like four different kinds of oatmeal. There's blueberry, strawberry, blueberries and cream, strawberries and cream. Peaches and cream and banana and cream. And they are absolutely delicious. I love to eat that. Put uh, Add a cup of um, unsweetened, well, sugar-free uh, fruit. The little sugar-free fruit cups. I just pour the liquid off of it and add um, some fruit to that once it's made. It's, it's a yummy little treat. And then I got some um, cream cheese because I saw a recipe of... Um, uh, pineapple cake recipe that I want to try and one of the ingredients was uh, a block of cream cheese 
So I got some cream cheese for that and some other recipes as well. And then my son wanted some cinnamon toast crunch cereal. So I got him some of that for breakfast in the morning. And sometimes he might have a bowl of cereal um, when he comes home from school as a snack. And then I just got me some little banquet um, spaghetti and meatball, little frozen dinners. That's just for a quick lunch, you know, if I need something to eat quickly. And, yeah, just something simple. I know it's not the healthiest, but, yeah, we can add a, add a little uh, serving of vegetables to it or a side salad or something like that. And, yeah, you have a good little lunch. And then, y'all, I don't know what it is, but right now I'm on a Fruity Pebble kick. <laughs> so I got me another box. My kids actually um, helped me eat the last box that I got. So I had bought a little small box, but this time I got a box a little bigger because, like I said, they helped me to eat that. So, yeah, those Fruity Pebbles are really good. And then we wanted something, something a little sweet, so I got this ice cream. Um, this is chocolate chip cookie dough. And I wanted to try these Twix ice cream bars. I have not tried these before. So, yeah, I'm going to give one of those a try. And then right back there in the middle, got some sharp, extra sharp cheddar cheese. Um, we like to just slice that and eat that with a piece of bread or some crackers or something. And then, um, <clears throat> excuse me. Got my son some uh, Rice Krispie Treats. That's to put in his little lunch. And he wanted some graham cracker, um, graham goldfish also for lunch and for snacking after school. Uh, got some more Daisy Sour Cream for recipes and also for some baked potatoes. Um, I had a, a loved one of mine to bring me a huge box of crab legs shout out to you boo boo thank you so much bought me a huge box of crab legs and boy am i going to be enjoying those with a nice baked potato on the side and probably some broccoli yes guys can't wait for that and then right back here behind that let's see if you can see i have a large can of pineapples supposed to be crushed pineapples but I'm thinking it says pineapple tidbits. But we're going to try to make it work. I'll crush them up some for this special little cake that I saw. And got a can of um, Van Camp pork and beans. Because my sweetie likes to eat hot dogs and pork and beans. So old school. Got him a can of pork and beans for that. And then last but not least guys. Got my son some more Lunchables. Because, like I said, he likes to eat these as a snack uh, after school. And he also will take some to school for his lunch. And that's all we got this week, y'all. Not too much. Just, just a little bit of stuff. And I've started to do something new. Now when I make my food orders, I no longer include my water. Because for some reason, if I put like two or three cases of water on an order like this they won't bring it so now what i do is i just I, i'll make a separate water order a separate water order so in a couple of days because i still have two cases of water left but in a couple of days i'm going to make an order when i just request four cases of water and that way i don't put so much stress on the delivery driver and i know that my water will make it to me well, anyway, guys, um, this is the end of my haul. I hope that you enjoyed it, and I hope that you see something that you can use or something that you need and didn't know that you need it. And, yeah, if you enjoyed this haul, don't forget to subscribe to my channel at Lowball Mama and give my video a thumbs up. And I will talk to you all in the next video. Bye, friends.